Hello from the National Weather Service in Pocatello. This is your Eastern Idaho planning briefing for April 26th. Today is Monday. Well, it's going to be an interesting day today. We've got some light snow accumulations expected in the mountains uh, throughout uh, the rest of today and tonight. And also a chance of afternoon thunderstorms today. So watch out for those. And we are expecting warming through the rest of the week. So good news, warmer and drier weather is on the way. But first we have to get through this weather system today. Satellite map is showing a lot of moisture being drawn up through Southern California and into Southeast Idaho. And that's going to be the cause of most of our precipitation today. Our low pressure center in the upper levels is still spinning over uh, Northern California and that's allowing all the south southerly winds to bring up all this moisture. But uh, as you can see behind that, uh, further west and north of that, we got some pretty, uh, pretty clear skies coming our way. So but we do have to get through this weather system first and our weather impacts today are mainly going to be thunderstorms and mountain snow. Our thunderstorms again mainly occurring in the afternoon hours. Weather map for this morning low pressure with the associated fronts uh, just off to our east uh, that is impacting our weather particularly the southeastern highlands with uh, pretty good chances of rain and mountain snow today. A little bit of snow, a uh, chance of snow up here in the central mountains as well. Uh, Snake River Plain looking at uh, mainly just rain. So as we fast forward into 6 p.m. today, that uh, area of low pressure still lingering just off to our east. Uh, and we are still seeing some pretty good chances of rain and mountain snow throughout the area today. And that will quickly clear out as we head into Tuesday. Still some lingering chances on Tuesday, but as you can see here, that low pressure center is starting to shift off to the east. We're starting to see this high pressure starting to gain control and we're going to see some warmer and drier weather starting Tuesday afternoon. Our thunderstorm potential today, southern half of Idaho is probably going to see if, uh, at least some isolated thunderstorm activity. None of that should be severe, but uh, should be aware that it will produce uh, some lightning once you uh, see some thunderstorms, so get some lightning out there as well. Snowfall amounts. Uh, today again just uh, isolated uh, or confined to the to the mountain regions uh, overall about uh, one to three inches but as you can see some of these mountain passes could see some higher amounts maybe about two to four inches up here in Rangelina summit heading up to Stanley and uh, about six to eight inches in Teton Pass today so if you're heading out to Jackson today or tonight you might see some slick conditions going out there Overall rainfall amounts for today going to be upwards of half an inch here in the southeastern highlands. McCammon, Soda Springs, Preston, Malad, all expecting over half an inch for the rest of the, the day today. Uh, around uh, uh, just over three tenths of an inch here, Pocatello, Idaho Falls. And once you get into the INL area, maybe just, uh, just a little over a tenth of an inch. Our high temperatures today. Still looking pretty cool with the uh, 50 degree weather here in Pocatello, 51, Idaho Falls, 51, uh, Montpelier, 48. But uh, as we head into the rest of the week, we're expecting uh, warmer temperatures each day throughout the week. And take a look at our forecast high temperatures for Friday, seeing 80 degrees starting to nose their way into southeast Idaho. So that's going to be our first time this season of seeing 80 degrees. And it's going to be dry, so hope you can uh, get out there and enjoy that. Uh, your outlooks, your temperature and precipitation outlook, still looking at some good chances of uh, above normal temperatures and below normal precipitation as we head into the first part of May. And just uh, to wrap things up here, our uh, main impacts for the week is just going to be today with some light snow accumulations in the mountains. A uh, chance of thunderstorms in the afternoon. And once again, the rest of the week is looking warm and dry. So that's going to conclude our weather briefing. We're going to talk to you again tomorrow. If you have any questions, give us a call. Look us up on our website, email us, or uh, send us a message on social media. Thanks for listening.